going on guys and welcome back to some more earthbound i love this music so much man it's like earthbound is such an amazing soundtrack like whoever whoever did this should get a high should have gotten a race let me just say that and we beat the first sanctuary boss and made the giant step in the last part in this part um we're gonna go back to onet now uh these enemies will run away from us and uh we're strong against them now Now, um, it's all we have left to do. There's nothing left we can do. Um, once you beat a Sanctuary boss, these enemies are just going to run away from you because we've absorbed a lot of power from it. I guess when these enemies are running away from you, um, could be a good time to go for the one or 20 and get me attack slug, but we're not going to do that. It's the rowdy mouse, which screw you and your guts. It's definitely easier to come down this area than come up. I will say that for sure. Now, I've I've I've, I've yet to say this about Earthbound. And I will say this now. This is a game that starts off pretty hard. Like, if you're you can be caught off guard with the Titanic ants, like forty HP bite attacks. Really, like with Frank. Hey you, the boy says do not enter. Can you read it? No. What a rebellious kid. Come on, the Iron Police and no. Now, you can be caught easily caught off guard by the Titanic Ant's 40 HP bite attack, or even like Frank, like his uh knife attack. Or the sharks. Like, um Earth this game starts off kinda hard, but I will say, this game does get gets progressively easier the later you get. Now, I want to see if these NPCs say anything different. Hooray, the sharks are gone from your game. Now I can go in, so I don't have any money to play the games. Now, um, we didn't exactly, um, show the hotel. I was waiting until this specific moment to show the hotel. Even though we can heal from Frank, I still want to show the hotel because a certain message is going to appear. And also, I should point out, you can also call your dad in these hotels. Anyway, so, um, now we're gonna go to the hotel. Welcome to the hotel on it. And I was one say, no, when I say it cost you $35, would you like to say yes? Ness. Ness. Yes, I'm a friend you have never met before. My name is Paula. Can you hear me calling you? I am Paula. That was the Paula girl the people in on it were talking about. So uh, we got a message from her. That's I want to save that until a bit. You'll need to be a real target for the sharks. You better be careful. Can you believe it? A group of ruffians spent their spitted their gum on me. I was passing by and you were talking to this guy. Good morning. Here's a front top free copy of the morning newspaper. Here's his headline in the Onet Times. Tamer of the Sharks actually bought actually bought a boy in a red cap. Anyway, so um it's basically after you beat the sharks. Now uh now I'm actually going to um go and buy more I'm actually gonna go to the uh, burger shop and buy more hamburgers. You might be wondering why I'm doing that as the Sanctuary boss is now behind us, but the, the also, the other thing is, is like, the thing is also, like, we also have uh, more fights coming up, so uh, we're gonna buy a few of these. We can afford one more. Now we, have, we only have one dollar to lose, but um, there's a tough part coming up. This is the, we have to go to the police station. And, uh, it's actually no joke. We have money in the bank, though, so uh, let's just keep our money in the bank. Now, um... We go to the police station. I'd rather really be working as a parking meter cop. It's just been, it's just been too busy lately. I'm sick of it. So here you are, you little delinquent that came back from the giant set. Now you listen here, don't enter means that. Do not enter! You got that? And furthermore, blah, 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 blah. It's usually those tax evaders who blah, 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 blah. We don't have to block after, you know, blah, 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 blah. It's usually local wires that make a big deal of emergency meteor rights. Blah, 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 blah. We talk to him. Man, am I steam. Don't ever try talking to me. Don't even try talking to me. 
Why is Order 2 Sun closed? An emergency, of course. At times like this, kids should be playing Nintendo games. That is another fourth wall break. I don't know if it's exactly one, but I'm qualifying as one. Anyway, you sure you want to go to Tucson? Yes. Okay, Charles, follow me. He's basically gonna kid he's basically gonna take us in his uh office or whatever it is. Tell me what you got. See if you can get past by my best men. Yeah, hey small fry, you're from shaking your boots. Now, uh, yeah, uh, the cop and die. Now, uh, they have two attacks. They, have, they can attack and attack with a crushing shot. But obviously the latter does more damage. Like that. I'm gonna have to heal in the next fight, but, uh, we have to fight a series of these. At the present, there's a hamburger and a scrum I'm gonna have to throw something away, because I want that. We don't need the... We need the cold remedy for later, so I'm just gonna get rid of the skip sandwich. I'm oh, sorry for that. Um, my mixing software just ran earlier. You're obviously not stronger than any superhero. Anyway, so we gotta. Now we gotta actually use a uh, PSI life up because we cannot. Uh, he won't. He didn't crap tap at the crossing shop, but still. And we smash attack them. Yes. Don't get a level up out of this, unfortunately. The mayor's compl compliments give you a big head. Bring out fat boy. Wow, you're fat shaming this. Yeah, I'm gonna heal up. I'm gonna heal up. <laughs> and that's our first game over because I got cocky and thought I could beat him. Now, uh, that's the reason I decided to buy a bunch of hamburgers also because we lost our money. Now, um,. I'll also kind of explain what happens when you die in this game. When you die in this game, you lose all your- you lose half your money. We kept their dollar, though, but, um... And you lose all your PP, and I'll also explain more what happens when you die. So, um... Once we have more party members, so, um... I'm just gonna cut to where I was at PlayStation, so, um... I will see you guys momentarily after I leave the hotel, so see you guys in a second. All right, attempt number two at fighting the policeman. If we can level up out of this, we do. We w might have a significant advantage because um, we aren't we aren't exactly the most leveled. Um, we're decently leveled. They are faster than us, so we don't have enough speed. And can we get a level up out of this? No. Your average policeman is stronger than any superhero. That was the poli- this is the policeman that killed us the first time. I'm gonna see he's a healing. I knew it, I knew it was gonna do that. You do wanna save up your PP though. Another thing about the rolling hit counts, if, if it doesn't equal 30 when you the battle finishes, you just at the HP you are when the battle ends. So uh, that's another thing about the rolling hit points. So you can strategize with the rolling hit points, and that is what I did on the uh, when I fought Titanic Ant. No, 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 no. <laughs> you bastard! I'll see you guys in a second. We're gonna attempt number three. I don't want to go through your dollar. That's the thing. That's the problem with dying to these guys. That like, um, if you game over, you have to. No matter which like officer you're fighting, you have to fight all five of them over again. If I can get a level up, which I probably will eventually, like I, I will have an advantage. My offense will go up.
will say though, after you get to the, after you pass this area though, the hardest part of Earthbound is behind you. Like it gets progressively easier. With the occasional hard part here and there. I still don't get a level up out of this. Problem is that fucking smash attack. Like, I've been having some really good Earthbound luck, but then like my luck just ran out when I reached this police station. I think I need to check with the crushing shop. Alright, he's back to normal. We get a level up. No. We have to get a level up at some point. Bill the mayor's calling this game big head. Bring out fat boy. Yeah, the fat shamer was the one that got the smash attack. So he both fat shamed us and smash attacked us, and it caused us to die. Fuck you. <laughs> Sorry about sneeze, but fuck you, fat shamer. In less than I want the hamburger though. Um we have enough hamburgers. I'm going to take you apart right now, baby. I think I'm going to use the hamburger. I knew it was going to do that. I just knew it. And yeah, that's the last of the police force because, um... Finally, we're level up. Ness is now level 11. Offense went up by 2. Defense went up by 1. Speed went up by 1. Guess went up by 1. Luck went up by 1. Max V went by 3. Max V went by 1. Or I lost. That's it, buddy. You can't forget about me. I'm going to call for my boss. There's no way I can beat you in a straight competition, so get ready for my Super Ultra Tur Mambo Tango. Mambo Tango Fox Trot Martial Arts. And I uh, don't know what that is, but uh, yeah, he's no joke. We're gonna use our hamburger right off the back. He's, he's gonna be on guard for a turn and he's gonna do damage like that. God! I do not wanna have to fight these stupid cops again. I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal. Darvin and Lag Counter are really gonna focus because I do not want to fight these options again. And I'm out of this place finally. We don't even get a level up out of that. I didn't think you would do so well against the Mighty Onnit Police Force. You might want me to open the road to Tucson. Hang on, because I got a radio. My staff to give him the word. Beep, beep. We're, we're strong here. Do you read me? Hey, it's me, Captain Strong. Okay, listen, a kid named Ness will be there in a few minutes. He's a kid in a red cap. I want you to open the road to Tucson, Fran. I know that. I know that. Don't ask me why. Let's do it. There's an order. Strong out. Well, kid, I'm not going to question you now, but I do want to see you again. Good luck. Anyway, so, um, let's see what he says. Psst. I'm not really one of the gang. I'm a cop. You know, it'll look like it. You can be a detective. Good strong house, say you bastard, almost killed me. I'm playing Earthbound lately, I've been having a tough time. If you're at your part, no fucking shit, and that's another fourth wall break, by the way. Anyway, so now um we can go to the road to Tucson. And uh I wanna see there are new enemies we can encounter. I, I wanna go in this house first off. You know, in the, let's talk to this kid. I live right in the mouse's house. The mice don't know to exit mice. They're very kind. Boy, they're fast. I really love these guys. Please take my son along. He may look like a regular small mouse. You can leave you in if you're lost on me. Take my son along. Duck boy. You can change one of your items. Let's got the exit mouse. This is basically like the escape rope from Pokemon. Like, they can take out areas. And this is a new enemy. This is the Rambling Evil Mushroom. Now, these enemies can be kind of annoying because they can they can attack you and give you and get spatter mushroom, which, which will cause you a new condition, which is spores. You have to go to the hospital to get that healed. How close am I to a level up? Let me just, uh, give me So, um, I'm saying he's one of my hamburgers. Uh, we use a hamburger to get a hamburger. 
Anyway, so I want to give you some brilliant music that we're going to approach. This right here is none of them two song. What does he have to say? I'm not an enemy. I'm just a friendly mall. I think I have to sing between friends and enemies. See that I'm not even looking at them. Enemies look like humans with weird colored faces. Beware of them. However, if you can't get more powerful if you avoid your enemies. Pretty much any RPG in a nutshell. Now, uh, we get into a battle. But we instantly kill them. Anyway, so, um, welcome. Would you like me to tell you about Tucson? Tucson is a modern, clean hotel. There's a hospital in the wonderful Chaos Theater. There's a pole star preschool and a nice bus police station. If you're curious, you might want to check out Berglund Park. It's exciting. East of the town, you'll find a peaceful rest valley. On the inside of the village is Valley's Happy Happy Village. There's also a pizza parlor. Do you want me to know anything else? Well, tee -hee, I don't know anything else. Next time on Earthbound. Can't exactly fight that enemy. Next time on Earthbound. We're going to explore Tucson. I'll see you guys next time.